So we're continuing our discussion of how the route is, is plotted. So now let's go and take a look uh, inside insert methods to see what the method is for plotting a route. So I'm going to go here to R-O-U-T-E and I can see that there's a method called uh, plot route and what this method does is take a comma delimited list of locations and plots the route and the locations can either be in the form of a um, of uh, long lat values or explicit addresses so you can see here that in this particular case uh, we have um, a long lat value which are in an array format over here so you pass in a comma delimited list of um, of long lat values to this function so uh, let's close that down now so now what we're going to do is we're going to loop over all of the um, uh, entries in this array creating a string so we create an empty array here called text and then we push onto this array um, an open square bracket then the lat value then a comma then the long value then uh, the close square brackets. So this array now contains um, a whole bunch of entries that are in the form of square bracket, uh, latitude, comma, longitude, close square brackets. Then we do a join which takes the array and creates a single string from it that is comma delimited. Then we add into um, the uh, this text uh, variable the command plot root uh, using the map variable m2 and um, so then we basically create this M2 variable by getting a pointer to the second map. So the second map was called M2 and then we just do an eval on this command over here. So that's actually how we put the uh, root uh, on the map. So let's go quickly and take a look at that uh, in action again. So if we go now and click on our plot root you can see what's happened here is we've harvested all these lat and long values, constructed the appropriate JavaScript command, and then uh, executed it on this second map to object over here. So using um, the map control and the methods that the map control makes available to you in the dialog component, we've been able to create uh, quite a sophisticated mapping application uh, quite easily. Thank you very much for watching.